In this video, we are going to talk about M commerce or mobile commerce. Now, a lot of times, if you have an e commerce business or a store online, it works fine and opens up easily on a PC or on a laptop. But when it comes to mobile devices, most of the websites, I think 40% they are going to, you know, suffer a lot on a mobile device. Either they are not going to load their images, uh, it will be difficult to add the products, the card buttons, they will be difficult to, you know, press by a thumb or a finger. Then there will be problem with the navigation bars. They are not going to hide themselves. Uh, there will be smaller search bars or even I have seen websites where there are no search bars on, uh, you know, almost invisible search bar on a mobile device. So this is going to take a lot of time. Let me share with you a story. Once I had a client and she was complaining that her website is not loading on a mobile phone. And I, I, I tried to investigate and when I opened her website on my mobile phone and I checked her backlog, her images of her product she was loading were like 10 MB of images. So it was like four or five images, each was 10 MB and like 40 or 50 MB for a single page. I think it is not going to load even for uh, if we wait for five minutes on a mobile device. So these were the problems which I think a lot of people neglect and they don't take care of these issues. Now research says that by the end of 2021, 54% of all e-commerce sales will be just m-commerce or mobile commerce. Similarly, 77% of US citizens when they go into a physical store, they actually try to compare their product uh, prices actually on a mobile device. So these patterns are actually emerging. 65% of Google clicks are received on just mobile devices. So you can see more than almost 50 to 60% more than there are more users on a mobile phone than on a PC or a laptop. So most of the people they are using mobiles to access your website, your e-commerce store, they're shopping there. So I'm going to share with you the screen of Baymar research, which they were they done on 60 most popular e-commerce websites. And uh, now you can see that on the screen and you can see uh, at the bottom, there is no decent or acceptable. There is no good indication of the features that are related to um, those uh, mobile commerce. So they have tested against different criteria and different standards and most of the websites among these top 50, top 60, sorry, top 60 websites, they are failing. So you can see this is a major gap you can fill. You can jump into an e-commerce as an e-commerce UX designer and ask them that we have to optimize your website for a mobile app or mobile version. So that is all. You have to upgrade your m-commerce stats. I hope you will enjoy and apply these principles into your uh, studies or your website or your business. See you soon in the next lesson. Till there, take care and bye.